In today's video, I will be sharing with you guys my recently finished Spyclaw Swarm Shade Spire Waterband. Stay tuned and we'll see what these guys come out like. Alright guys, welcome to this showcase video where I finally get to show my finished Shade Spire Spyclaw Swarm models. I've had these in the box for far too long, it was about time. I had like one or two finished and I just pushed myself to get these last three models finished. Um, mostly on live stream, mostly on the Twitch stream I did these guys, especially this guy right here, Scritch Spyclaw himself. Um, we got this guy from start to finish on the stream, I'm pretty sure. And we had a lot of fun painting and we got to pick out a lot of cool details on him. Absolutely love the pose, I love how he's up on, I love how like he's not just on a bigger base but he's up higher than the rest of the models as well to make him stick out that little bit more. And then we have Kirk the Almost Trusted which is the first guy I painted from this I'm pretty sure. Um, he was done a long time ago but I got to finish off the base I think on the stream as well. But um, yeah I really like his pose, he's kind of very basic, he's just kind of in a hunched over pose like you're running with a spear but it still looks pretty awesome. And then we have the Festering Skaven, I like to call this guy, or I like to say this guy is in the Spider-Man pose. Uh, really, really unique pose, I think I can have a lot of fun converting this guy up. Um, and I think this is the only guy where like a cobblestone base isn't doing him any justice, he needs to be up high looking down on something from this pose. Um, and of course with that model, with the Festering Skaven, I went with the brown skin tone. And then to go the complete opposite with the hunger and scave and this guy, I went with the lighter skin tone which I was a little bit worried about at the start, but I managed to pull it off, I think. Um, I think he looks pretty nice, uh, well I think he looks pretty nice at the end, so I'm, I'm kind of happy I went with a different skin tone. And then finally we went on to the lurking scaven, who this guy is ready to jump into any battle by the looks of it. Um, you're not going to see many scaven models with this kind of pose, which is why I love this guy. Um, definitely you can have plenty of opportunities to convert this guy up to something awesome. But that's it, it's kind of short and sweet for this video. Um, but as I said, I did these guys, I did a lot of, or I did the kind of the last two or three on the Twitch stream. And we had a lot of fun painting them up on that. So if you want to see how I kind of did all these from start to finish, make sure to check out the streams. Um, more often in the future and if you like this video make sure to hit the like button comment and subscribe and once again thanks for watching and i will see you guys in the next video